art by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTSDILL to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. ...to do on their website and come join us for a fun, friendly F&M environment. Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Clots Productions and welcome back to another Magic the Gathering gameplay. For this match, we have Josh playing Blue White Delver and he's going up against everybody's favorite Tezzeret player, Shower G. Josh is on the play and started off by laying down a Seachrome Coast and casting a Delver of Secrets. Shower then put a Drowned Catacomb into play. The Delver trigger didn't reveal anything for Josh, then he played a Ponder but chose to shuffle the cards away and draw another one. He then attacked with his Delver, taking Shower to 19. Shower laid down a Phyrexia's Core on his next turn. He then played a Mycosynth Wellspring and searched for a Swamp. Josh played a Thought Scour at the end of the turn, but for some reason he targeted Shower with the Mill Effect and then drew a card. His Delver trigger still didn't reveal anything, then he put a Plains into play and attacked with the Delver again, taking Shower to 18. He then played a Snapcaster Mage and flashed back his Ponder and chose to rearrange the cards this time. Shower just put a Swamp into play on his next turn, then Josh attacked with his Delver and a Snapcaster, taking Shower down to 15. Then post-combat, he played a Geist of St. Traft and followed it up with a second Delver. At the end of the turn, Shower sacrificed his Wellspring to his core to gain a life and search for another Swamp. He then played a Phyrexian Metamorph on his turn to copy Josh's Geist and kill them both with a Legend Rule. Josh then attacked with his team, taking Shower down to 12. Shower laid down on Dark Slick Shores, which came into play tapped. He then played a Mimic Vat. At the end of the turn, Josh flashed in a Restoration Angel and blinked his Snapcaster Mage, giving his Thought Scour flashback. He then targeted Shower with the Thought Scour again and drew another card. Josh then attacked with his team again, taking Shower down to 5. Then Shower put a Braid Rune into play and played a Curse of Death's Hold. The curse killed all of Josh's creatures except for his Angel, so when the Snapcaster died, Shower exiled it with his Mimic Vat. Josh then laid down a Glacial Fortress and attacked with his Angel again, taking Shower down to 3. Then Shower played a Worm Coil Engine on his next turn, which resolved, however Josh immediately bounced it with a Vapor Snag, so Shower scooped it up, giving Josh the win and taking them to Game 2. So that's it for this gameplay, I hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version in the annotations at the end, along with links to my vlog and my Let's Play Duels of the Planeswalkers 2013. If you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites, then subscribe to be notified when more videos are online. 